Hello friends, I'm Parwes and this is our first video in Python speech to text recognition. So in this video we are going to have a simple introduction to speech recognition library and also we are going to create a practical example of uh, converting our speech to text using speech recognition library. So the speech recognition library is a good speech recognition library for Python and uh, speech recognition is a, a library that helps uh, in you in performing speech recognition in Python. It support, uh, supports uh, for several engines and APIs. Uh, uh, you can use it online and you can use it offline. Uh, and also uh, Google Cloud Speech API, it has Google Cloud Speech API. Uh, Microsoft Bing voice recognition, uh, iBeam speech to text, and etc. So now, uh, first of all, uh, you need to install a uh, speech recognition library. So now I'm going to open my terminal and I want to show you that how you can install uh, speech recognition. Okay, guys, now first of all, you need to install speech recognition. So you can install that pip install speech recognition and after that hit enter so uh, now uh, I'm waiting for the installation and uh, it will be uh, installed okay guys because I have already installed this now you can see requirement already satisfied also, if you're using microphone, uh, then you need to install Pi Audio. So pip install Pi Audio and hit enter. Okay, guys, now the Pi Audio, audio installation has been completed, and you can see. Uh, okay. Now after uh, installing, uh, now we need to import, so let me just first import speech recognition as SR and now let me create a main method in here. Okay, now the first thing I need, I'm going to initialize the recognizer, so R sr dot recognizer okay now after uh, initializing the recognizer you need to mention the source so the source uh, it will be a microphone we are using microphone uh, in this video but also you can use uh, audio files recorded audio files in your directory and you can convert the speech to text but in this video we are using online uh, uh, speech that I, I will talk and it will convert that so this is now the source for the source let me write wit wit is our dot because we are using microphone uh, source and uh, now uh, we need to uh, sometime we need to uh, adjust uh, the noises because there will be some noises to handle uh, ambient noise uh, you will need to use the adjust for ambient noise uh, you can simply write uh, in here so r dot adjust for ambient noise and you need to add your source now let me print and please say something okay after this we need to listen to the source for that you need to create an audio in here and r dot listen and we want to listen to the source after this we need to use recognizer to convert our audio into text part 
now you need to give a try in here try and print you have said you have said so uh, okay you have said r dot uh, because uh, I have said in the first that uh, you can use different APIs for example we we are using recognize Google but uh, we have uh, different in here we have Bing uh, so you can see recognize Bing recognize Google Cloud and IBM uh, they are different we are using Google so recognize Google and you need to add the audio in here okay now in the accept exception as E so if uh, we receive an exception we need to give an error in here and we need to convert the error to string like this okay so now this is uh, our simple code uh, you can see it's so easy in Python that you can convert your text uh, your speech to text and now let me uh, call my main method in here So now uh, I'm going to run this and hopefully we have an error in here uh, exception an indent we have indent problem in here so let me just uh, I think we have in here problem yeah and yeah the problem was yeah in here okay now this is uh, the complete code and let me just run this hello world Now you can see hello you have said hello world now let me just run it again how are you now you can see how are you so now uh, this was uh, that we have recorded uh, that we have uh, converted our uh, speech to text successfully now sometime you need to uh, save your audio for example if I said how are you I want to save this uh, for this uh, for saving uh, it's so simple and easy uh, there are different format that uh, you can use uh, for saving let me just create another Python file in here I will add the, so the source code to the video description you can check that so now this is our example too uh, we need some uh, codes that are repeated let me just copy from my previews we need this import and uh, also we need uh, to copy these codes diff main and paste it in here like this okay also we need to print in here print recognizing recognizing now and now we need to create uh, our recognized speech using Google so as we have created in the previous section so we need to create a try and we let me just print you have said you have said r dot 
recognize Google and you need to add your audio in here and also let me print audio recorded successfully successfully and we need to add except exception uh, as e and we need to print the exception error plus str e so now let me uh, okay so now uh, we have now we need to write our audio uh, for this uh, with open you can you need to give uh, so the uh, first uh, the title for example I want to record it audio dot wave there are different formats that you can use we are using wave format and for the uh, this is the mode I want to give it WB as if if dot write audio dot get so you can see we have a a i f f uh, we have uh, raw data we have wave data we are using wave data in here so now let me just uh, call my main method in here so now let me run this again and I want to record the voice so let me run it how are you how are you you can see audio recorded successfully and if you see your directory we have a recorded audio in here dot wave and if I just uh, open this show an explorer and let me run it you can see that this is uh, the recorded sound so uh, this was the first video uh, in the next video I will show you uh, another thing in a speech recognition uh, I want to read that when you for example, when you want to say facebook.com, it will open you a facebook.com URL. It will recognize facebook.com and it will open. So I will add the source code to the video description. Please subscribe to my channel, like the video and also share the video.